Now, a lot of you may think that AI is new, but it's not. It's actually been around for years. The government has been using it. It's just been as of November uh, 2022 that it's been exposed to the public. And so now there are so many companies that are adding AI onto their platforms and making it available to um, entrepreneurs. And that's why you have to realize that you can't sleep on AI. It's It's been here. If you think about whenever you've uh, um, made a phone call and they press one for this, press two for that, that's AI. Yes, it has eliminated some jobs, but many of the jobs it has eliminated are low paying jobs that then should free people up actually to, to pursue their dreams. So that's one way is it's been, it's been being used. Another way is your uh, navigation, depending on your age, may not even know what a map is or how to even read a map to get from one destination to the other. So navigation now in your cars or on your phone, that's all AI. Uh, chats, when you go, a lot of times when you do um, support and you're chatting, it, you're not, many times you're not chatting with a real person, you're chatting with a bot. And a bot means that there's a lot of questions that are repetitively asked. So instead you have the bots and they um, start become smarter and smarter by understanding the questions that people are asking. And so sometimes you can get your answer a lot quicker than waiting for a human to research and look up some things.